obviously no dean to be trifled with, but how much importance does he place on tradition? Well, in spite of what everyone says, I personally think that the British people, as a people, are a very traditional people. We like... Every human being needs to have roots. They need to know where they come from. Look at the way the Americans spend endless dollars on genealogical tables. I mean, we all need to know where we come from. Uh, a Muslim said to me the other day, if you don't know where you've come from, how can you know who you are or where you're going? And in that sense, we need tradition. That sense of continuity and a sense of not just being here for ourselves, but here because of those who've gone before and for those who are going to follow after. And tradition reinforces this very strongly. It's part of a moving tapestry. <laughs> Attachment to a cavalry regiment as idiosyncratic as the 4th 7th Royal Dragoon Guards can at first bemuse an American officer like Major Joe Ruffini. It was, it was quite surprising. I actually first observed it, observed it with the 13th 18th Royal Hussars who were visiting uh, our cavalry unit in Mannheim, Germany in the 70s. And we were on the parade field. They were invited down for a review, past the tanks and the troops marched. And when they played the British national anthem, there were three officers there from the 13th 18th who immediately found the nearest chairs and sat down and just went on talking. And of course the Americans are standing at attention and here's the British officers and they're sitting down and they're talking and carrying on. So when it was over, I went over to them and I said, you know, you're gonna have to explain it. And uh, I hope I have, with all due respect to the regiment, I have this right. The way it was explained to me was that they were being honored by Queen Mary. They're called Queen Mary's own at a banquet one evening. And I'm not exactly sure who at the head table had had quite a bit to drink and did not really feel like standing when it was played. And, and the story goes, Queen Mary just turned around everybody at the table and said, you know, gentlemen, don't worry about standing up. Just continue to sit. And from that day on, they continue to sit. And they, they never stand up.